Peck here in Nevada. Senator Harry Reid commemorating victims of 9-11 and their families. He put out a statement. It read, uh, the, the memory of that terrible day will never fade and the many innocent lives will never be forgotten. But we didn't allow the terror to break us. We rose again together, stronger and more determined than ever. The North Las Vegas Police Department tweeting, quote, Today we remember those who lost their lives in the tragic attack on 9-11. And Governor Brian Sandoval is ordering all flags in Nevada to be lowered to half staff today. They'll stay that way from sunrise to sunset in honor of the Patriots Day, along with the uh, National Day of uh, Service and Remembrance. Governor Sandoval speaking at a ceremony in Fallon today in recognition of the men and women who serve our nation. Right here, Firefighters and other first responders gathering outside Fire Station 5 earlier this morning. The bells rang at 6.59 a.m. Pacific time, the same time the South Tower collapsed at the World Trade Center. The tolling of the bells is a firefighter tradition to remember the people who died on 9-11. When you're a firefighter and you're going down the street, there's things that are going through your mind. What am I going to see when I get there? What should I do when I get there? And I can imagine what they were thinking when they were going on the word or that World Trade Center. So it means a lot to every firefighter, especially knowing what those people were probably feeling when they were on the way. The 9-11 tribute, including the raising of a special flag presented to the New York City Fire Department. They have special orders to fly it only on September 11th at half staff over a piece of metal from the World Trade Center.